Hello and welcome to another Scardcast Battle Report. Today, the forces of chaos face the forces of chaos in this Age of Sigma Battle Report. Let's begin. The Dark Kid. Hello everyone, we've got Slanesh Heed Knights versus Nurgle playing First Blood from the uh, mi basic mission pack. Uh, it X Planet in Mississauga. That's right, let's dive into the armies. Today I am playing a single battle regiment. Um, it is the Lurid Host, which is an invader's host. I do have two generals, Sigvald the Magnificent and a Lord of Pain. I do have Glutos in the army as well. And then for my um, battle line, I have two Mimirdesh, uh Pain Bringers, and I have the Claw Spears, and then other units. I've got a unit of Fiends, I have a unit of Blissfarb Seekers, and a unit of Mimirdesh Twin Souls, my faction terrain, and of course, the mirror. Mirror, mirror on the wall. There you have it. Um, that's pretty much it. Okay, Lionel, what kind of filth have you brought today? All right, so what we're looking at here is uh, a variation of my LVO list. Um, I was experimenting while I was there and I really, really enjoyed it, so I modified it a little bit. But first off, these froggies, these guys right over here, these are my beasts of Nurgle. I got 12 of them. I got a unit of three Nurglings, yep. and they're there for my clutch summoning. Yep. Uh, Sloppity Bile Piper, because he's amazing. Lots of really cool aura effects. And this little lady, partially painted, is actually my Count as Festus. Nice. Yeah, he's on a, Festus is on a 40 mil base. Cool. So I get a little female action happening in my uh, list, which is really, really cool. This is um, actually my Lord of Afflictions, or at least one for now. I'm working on three more. And of course, the trees. The trees, and these are each individual beasts of Nurgle. Normally a good thing. Normally. Not let's see how much you. depravity I get. <laughs> I'll be exciting. Not against you. <laughs> okay, let's dive into deployment. <laughs> the Hedonites will be facing off against the Nurgle in this mission. It's a hold one to get points. It's hold two to get more points. It's hold more than your opponent to get more points. Every turn you have to pick like a secondary battle tactic to essentially try and score in the middle of the of your turn. And then we each have a grand strategy. Mine is to keep Glutose alive. And Lionel's is to keep any of these little frogs alive. Or the Nurglings. Maybe. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see what happens with that. But they do lots of mortal wounds when they charge, so it's going to be super dangerous. I've decided to put uh, Myrmidesh, uh, Bliss Barbs, the, the Lord of Pain, uh, more uh, Myrmidesh, more uh, the, the Twin Souls, the Claw Spears, Sigvald, and of course the Fiends, because he has some Deep Strikers, so I want to make sure. He doesn't get back here. Some uh, strategic e reserves. I'm a battle regiment, so I just deployed everything and then let Lionel do his thing. Yeah, I got this here and then these. Oh uh, yes, they're in uh, in essentially teleporting. The Nurglings have to come in, in reserve, close to yeah reserve. They have to come in near a piece of terrain because they're yeah, festing anywhere it. Anywhere on the table. Yeah, nine inches away from you. Correct. And then the big fly guy can also come down Basically as well. Strike. Other than that, that is it. So what we're going to do there is we're going to go ahead and do um, give you the first turn, Lionel. No. Yep. I am stunned. Oh, really? Yeah, with the way you kind of like hugged this carter. I didn't do I nothing. I was not expecting you to give me I don't. Turn. I didn't do nothing. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> um, however, <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and I'm not going to put anything in reserve. I'm going to go ahead and keep everything on the board with what? my... Yeah, with is it my. Because you have nowhere to go. It's because with your first move, you're gonna push out, and then you could teleport and teleport, and literally like block out the whole table. No, <laughs> it's not true. Lies. You're not so smart. Lies. I do not. Maybe you are smart. I do not want you to like block off the whole table for me. And if you get close to Sigvald, I want him to go up and punch you uh, early. Let's just like go kill some of these froggies. Isn't it enough that I feed your whole entire army? It's gonna be great. You have to deny me. And I love it. It's gonna be awesome. The uh, the cycle of corruption is on number five. Yeah. Which is uh, there. There we go. Minus one to charge. No piling. And no piling, which is good that it's happening so early in the game. Yeah. Because it's one of the best ones. And I'm very happy that is the case. So with that, we're on to turn one for Nurgle. 
And here we are after the first turn. Glorious first turn. Glorious. He just moved and then brought Nurglings in. That was it. Done. He uh, took a conquer, which means he, at the end no. of his turn... aggressive expansion. Uh, sorry, aggressive... I'm still learning the lingo, <laughs> Lionel. He needs to hold two objectives and a holy in his deployment zone, a territory, yeah. which is that one and that one. Yeah. And also then he just, he's good. like literally just pushing up the flank this way. I'm you know, Making it hard for me to take that objective by putting Nurglings, because you can't come within three inches of the enemy with a move. Yeah, but you charge him. Yeah, sure, and then throw away whatever to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, D3 mortal wounds. Sacred number. Eight. <laughs> he'd come around too and just make sure that Sigvald dies for you, you sure. You know what? You're right. You know what you should do? Stay there. You know what? The past turn. I might way, actually. And then I, then I win the... <laughs> then I'll win the, the initiative roll and take it. It'll be very, very entertaining. Very, very fun. So with right. that, let's dive into uh, my first my turn. Mm. So it'd be my turn one. I'm gonna do some actions and stuff. Uh, the twin souls get to go ahead. They're gonna go ahead and do their um, twin soul thing. Uh, twin soul thing, which will be the reroll hit rolls or reroll wound rolls. Yeah, right the, now. the key to using that unit is to think a couple of turns Correct. ahead. So you want to pick the one that you. I'm gonna least use right now. Right now, and so then eventually I'll get the 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 feel no pain or the ward save, which is the most important against you. No, so once again, I disagree. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, so with that, let's dive in. Um, so that's that for them. I have to do my heroic action, my strategic thingy, and we'll come back uh, after my turn. But ideally, the plan, there's two things I can do. I can kind of stay back and just take an objective. You coward. You know what? <laughs> you know what? I don't like your attitude, Lionel. <laughs> It's gonna be fantastic. Right, yeah. Okay, let's see. Let's see what Glutos can eat. Glutos. Here we are after my movement phase and hero phase. I didn't get the ward save. I did not get the ward save. Our Glutos, no! So he's uh, in a precarious position. However, all my movement in, um, I forced uh, Lionel to redeploy one of his toads onto the forced objective. Me. That's right. Or it was planned, right? So, <laughs> so we'll see what happens there. Uh, right now, of course, I have uh, five, six, seven, eight models to his eight because they count as two models each <laughs> which means i need to try and get either kill one or try and get another model on which will definitely be interesting and we'll see how this goes so with that i'm going to go into the shooting phase i did slow him he is he's half move all that good stuff mainly to make his charge harder that way for some reason <laughs> which is it's fine. Maybe I want to. And I'm just trying to move block here, although he can charge and kill and charge and kill and charge and kill and then charge through. So there's like some good play with that sort of thing there. Which no, really I mean, it's still a really, it was a good move. Yeah, I need to. Really That's what the claw spears like, are there for, is just yeah. to be annoying. Exactly. Right. But with that, we're going to dive into the shooting phase, and the Bliss Barb Seekers are going to shoot. And they're going to all out attack with the command point. And I'm going to do one, two, three, four, five. Yay! <laughs> I'm here to give you as much power as I can. <laughs> I love it. Thank you so much, buddy. Anyway, we'll come back after my shooting, see what happens. Okay, so after shooting, I got three different ones wounded from my Bliss Bard Seekers. Nice. Not bad. Which means I will be getting three depravity points, plus my commander over here, who cut himself <laughs> to, so to get another one. Right? So I got four at the end so far. Yeah. Uh, there's still two like more two that keepers, I could. Right? Almost. <laughs> there are two that I could potentially wound to get uh, yeah, some more as well. So with that, we're going to dive in to uh, my charge phase. And this is going to be a fun one. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to charge Sigvald. Because he's a baddie. What is it? Uh, eleven. But he gets plus three as a roll. That's pretty good. Yeah. Well, actually, he might be within ten and a half. I'll just actually let me check and then we'll tell you. So Sigval is the important one because having him in, regardless of what happens, helps me take that objective. He is within eleven. Well, eleven and a half. So he needs to roll an eleven. He gets plus three to his roll. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this here. Haya! He needs an eight. Ooh. <laughs> That's okay. Bless I will be using my last command point for the turn. There it is. For the reroll. Come on, Sigvald. First among equals. He doesn't make it. Which now means he has to try and get in. The fat man? The fat man. I can appreciate it. Come on, fat man. Let's go. Yeah. Uh, he's in. He is. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> Hooray. He is ready to rock and roll. And like, I like a it. coward. Exactly. That's how this works. Okay, so let's dive into what he's going to do here. Uh, and that, by that, I mean he's just going to attack you. 
And end of the charge phase, Glutos only put four wounds on the guy that I need to kill, which does mean I don't get my battle tactic, which is not good. Not good at all. Probably should have tried to run Sigval instead of charging just to make sure he was on after seeing how they ran, but that's okay. Uh, I do get six depravity points though, because I got one, two, three, four, five, because he took wounds from being diseased, and six because he cut himself before the game even started. <laughs> I'm going to give you two armies in this game. I love it. It's two fantastic. Okay, so with that, it is the end of battle round one. I do only hold one. I don't hold two. So I'm really on the back foot now. Let's see what the initiative roll holds. Yeah, I scored one point. I did. It was a gamble, but it but was... You'll more than make up for it in the latter rounds. Yeah. I am just feeding you. It's completely fine. We'll yeah. have some fun. Yeah, I yeah. never give up. This is how... Oh, this, is how Slaanesh, this, is, is, this is how Slanesh likes it. I'm pretty sure I'm going to get my ass kicked. <laughs> <That's what laughs> okay, I'm let's ready? roll. Four uh, initiative. I rolled a two. I rolled a six. You can choose. I, I can choose. And, and I believe... A, there's a saying in AOS. Yes. You take turn two, you give it away turn three. There you go. Makes yeah. sense. So he's taking turn two, and we'll yeah. move on to battle round two for the froggies. Oh, uh, yeah. Broken ranks on that. Okay, so it is the start of the second turn. Hero phase, the spell didn't go off. He's gone for broken ranks. He wants to clear, kill my battle line claw spears, um, which makes sense considering the seven toads looking at him and some nurglings and more toads. So <laughs> let's see what I can do. Hopefully I can hold and then have enough oomph to like bounce back after this happens considering I'm already at a point deficit. So I'm looking forward to seeing how I can challenge myself to get through and get as many points as I can. And here we are after the movement phase. As you can see, lots of the little toadies are going to try and kill that. But they redeployed after the Nurkings move to just oop, get some extra distance to make sure Sigval doesn't get charged and murdered. His pretty face get marked? Yes, yeah, right. Yeah. They are sacrificing themselves dearly to help Sigval, which is good. Tactically, it actually really helps me. Just gives me some breathing room. They're dead anyway, so I might as well just create a lot of space there. Over here, uh, because he's slowed, he can't physically disengage from me, which is hilarious. Terrible. <laughs> Terrible. <laughs> so I have one less D3 mortal wounds to worry about over here. But it'll be four D3 mortal wounds. Plus, he does mortal wounds when they charge, like when they attack and stuff. So a lot of things that are happening there. And then big uh, plague guy has come in with a nine. Uh, Again, this is the Lord of Afflictions, not just Husk go. Oil. Yep. Uh, so he is a hero. I know it's not exactly the model. It's all good. He's a he's a big nasty hero guy that's gonna go and try and kill or just disrupt my flank. Yeah. But that means he's committed now, which means I can now uncommit my I can commit my fiends basically, which is like a big thing as well. Bring it, bring it. They say. Glutos is just so happy. He's like, ar, 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 ar. he's just <laughs> super happy in the middle of the board. The affliction has gone across where disease is now plus one on the roll, so uh, which will be really useful. Okay. And at the end of my movement, um, it goes up by one. Moments, it yep. goes up by one. Yeah. So he's up to two, and it's going to be on threes that he takes more. That's okay. He's just happy about the depravity. He's going to be, he's going to be, you know, Only enjoying. If he lives. Yeah, it's true. He just, Only if he lives. It's true. Eight is 16 wounds, so we'll see. We'll see if he can survive. <laughs> if he can, that'll be great. If not, then that'll be sad. So than that, let's dive into no shooting. So it's just the charge phase. Mm -hmm. So you can roll away. We'll put it on camera here so oh, folks can see. Camera? Oh, yeah. It's big let's, time. Uh, let's see this guy. I'm really curious to see whether he makes it in or not. Yeah, plus you still have one command point. And I you, might have one command point. Which you can potentially use. Oh. Not with a Do seven. I care as much? I kind of care. I have plenty of opportunity to okay. do else. He wants to try and make it in. He is using his last command point for this. Booyah! Makes it in with a nine. Look and at that. There he goes. Very that's a nice. nine. That's an uh, Oh, well, 11. makes a nine. He makes it with an 11. <laughs> There you go. With Don't deny me. Yeah, well, you know, you're trying to get in and just get annoying. Yeah, I just and, want to um, muck up as many things as I possibly oh, it's, can. Oh, that sounds like fantastic, which is great. I think that's a great idea. Uh, Makes me smile time. inside, you know, it's one of those things. Right to there. Uh, excellent. And I will... Uh, how many uh, within six, my good sir? On a two plus, you take D3 yeah. moral runes, okay? That's excellent. So two plus, is it? Yes. Yay! You take three moral runes. I take three. Oh my goodness, one has one left. Good job. Oh, you, you count down. Okay. Yeah. I yeah, I have out. one left. No, no, that's that's that's, that's atrocious. That's exactly that's how the game works. It's, it's um, I'm going to. Uh, how many are within four or three? 
Um, oh, I think you have four. Yeah? Well, yeah, you have four. Okay, so I will be unleashing hell Absolutely. with four of them. I put two wounds on him. That's going to be a depravity point if I ever saw one. I am uh, so, you'll, I'm you'll so excited get. about that. You'll definitely get it. All right. Uh, this, okay, let's this go. Right over here. He needs gonna, to not roll snake guys. Let's let's not. Okay, roll he snake. doesn't. So <laughs> this guy is gonna can't get to him. That's right. He's but he's gonna, gonna, gonna go across. right here. Excellent. No, I can't jump across. Yep. Because I can't ignore scenery. Correct. In AOS, I would have to measure up and order. Yep. That's how that, that works. So on a two plus, mm -hmm. you take. Two, two mortal wounds. wounds. I believe that just kills one of them. Go ahead, pull up. I will pull this one out. All right. Then I will come at you with over. over yes, here. sir. And that'll be a make it enough. A seven. Oh shit! And this gonna, guy's going to jump in as well. And on a two plus. No. Nope. Okay. Uh, this guy. Yep, that one right there. He, ooh, he does it's make it as well. Sacred number. Very nice, very nice. Does he care? I don't know, does he? He does. And he will do a... Three? Three, there you go. Nice. That one spanned quite a bit. It's kind of fun. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and just pull that one. And make that guy's charge a little longer. Yeah. And I've taken... I have one wound remaining. I will now activate that. Yeah, so you will go with him. Yeah, I will. Yeah, might as well. I have one wound left. Uh, who do I want to put it on? I'm no, going to no, put no, it no. on this guy. That guy right there? Nope. Okay. This guy over here? Yep. He will make it with a six. Six, but Seems. I kind of want to go a little deep. Six and a half. Yeah, I'm going to go roughly to there. Okay. To He's just going to hop in like so. He's going to be... Yeah, no, it makes it. Just yeah. put him. Just, yeah, so there you go. It to that, I like it. Uh, and does he rest. care? He does. he does, and he's going to kill at least one. Just one. He does. Blah, blah. Okay, three more toads. Uh, yeah, but only one or two are going to be... Correct. And... He's just choosing which one he wants to put on there. Yeah, I'm going to go here now. Okay. So that toad makes it in. makes it. Look at that. He's like, ribbit. <laughs> does he hit Glutos? He, he does. does. Four, two. Takes two. Glutos has taken oh, two more oh, wounds. <laughs> One, two, down two, 14 remaining. This guy over here. Okay, he's gonna try and make it into, he does. He does. He's going seven. Yeah, I'm kind of tempted. Maybe I go six. Oh, he might just go and try and kill some of the pain bringers. But I, Very nice. I really don't like that guy. You don't like, no, you don't like Glutos? Really. What has he nah, ever done to really. you? So what I'm gonna do is yeah. I'm gonna move my seven. Yes. Yeah. Come Land up. right above here. <laughs> yes. Engage these guys. Okay. That makes sense. Stretch you out a little bit. Yep. And he uh, has one wound taken. Yes, he has. And on a two plus one, he has one wound taken. Yes, sir. Okay. Does he hit Glutus? No. And now this guy. That little toad right there. Will he make it? He yeah. does as well. With a 10, he just really wants to get involved. Does he hit Glutus? Does he hit him? He does. He does. For. What? One, one mortal wound so down to 13 remaining oh, no. glutos is uh is is living la vida loca <laughs> and then the last toad on that side or you can do one of these three toads i am feeling there we go he's just getting aggressive here i like it i am gonna go with this guy right here yep there he goes yeah He's gonna make it in. Yeah, just blocking that off. Yeah, Excellent. well, I'll block both of them off. Does he do some damage? Does he? Yes. He does. And how much does he do? Two. Two. He will kill one. So I will kill this one. You get one Okay, there is one remaining. All of a sudden, hey, look. Yeah, one remaining. Cool. And then the last guy. And you're within four. Okay, so I'm done. I'm done with that. Yeah. I'm gonna go here. I like it. And he makes it in as well I with a very you know, large charge. Oh, that puts me right into Pretty Boy, but one is not going to take on Pretty Boy. No. And wow. one is valuable in this situation over here, so I'm just going to drop it over here. Cool. That's outside of three. Yep, that's fine. Uh, does he hit uh, Glutos? Time. He does, and Glutos takes another more wound. One more. Glutos is down to 12 wounds. Not bad. Woo! I got off lightly there. Not bad. I did get off lightly. I think it was, light. I think it was about. Bad. No, no, I got off lightly. <laughs> considering, <laughs> considering it could have gone terribly wrong. Oh well, no! I mean, you screen. I That's did. not lightly. You well, position right. Sorry. Okay, good. I'll take that as a plus. Yes. Yeah, position right. Okay. Like <laughs> Let's go into the fight. Yes, sir. 
And that's the end of the turn. Gluto survived! Yes! How do you do that? Uh, he has a cool command ability <laughs> where if he kills things, all the wounds he overkills by, um, just heal him. <laughs> so yeah, didn't he, know that. <laughs> and then he basically went from like almost dead to full wounds again. It was fantastic. It was not fantastic. It was amazing. It was not fantastic. Other than that, you decided to stop trying to kill him and try to kill other stuff. And because of that, I got seven depravity points this turn, which yeah. means I'm up to 13 depravity points. So what is that, two keepers? That's one keeper. Yeah. That's one keeper. <laughs> Feels like two. That is correct. Okay, so now we move on to my turn, which I'm really excited about. One more important detail. Yes? I scored five points. You did. Well, I can't really, you know, get back to the points here. There's lots of points. So if I can double turn and do some crazy amounts of damage and kill all these toads, which is nigh impossible. <laughs> but uh, I'll try. You know, it'll be good. It'll, I'm gonna. Well, you got Sigvolt. It's exciting. Clear path to vote there. Well, I, I have a plan, okay? I have a plan, and this plan will involve me just killing things, which will be great. Okay. It's a good plan. Uh, yeah, exactly. <laughs> I think my biggest plan is just going to go, uh, is going to be broken ranks for this turn. <laughs> I'm just going to kill that guy. That's going to be my, the, that's guy the, guy? That's, the guy that's wounded. Sounds good. Just going to go for broken wounded. ranks. Yeah, it, yeah, it'll be exciting. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Okay. Okay, so end of the hero phase. I do have 14 wounds left on Glutos, so he, oop, he has his ward saved now. Excellent. He spent a command point to do the gluttony thing again, which is exciting. They took up. Yeah, well, there's nothing I can do about that. That's just gonna kill a bunch of guys and give me some depravity, which will be exciting. Uh, I have to kill this thing, which is exciting. Uh, of course, at the end of the movement phase, I will be bringing in a keeper. <laughs> and he stabbed himself to get some wounds, which will be exciting. And then we're just gonna just move into the movement phase. My aim is to try to kill him. I'm gonna have to kill this to get points. And then I'm going to, um, and then I'm going to essentially send these uh, twin souls to kill stuff and then him to kill stuff. Okay, and then the fiends can now come into the battle. So let's see what they can do as well. Boom! Crazy! End of the movement phase. I did uh, summon a uh, keeper of secrets using all my depravity points with the Lord of Pain. The fiends have moved up. I need to kill that, so I need to put as much damage as I can into it. Um, and this is its his finest hour, which is exciting. I decided to move the Myrmidesh out this way, and then Sigvald came down this way as well. But now it's the end of the movement phase, and it is mirror time. Mirror, mirror on the wall. That's right. You shouldn't have uh, looked into the mirror on sixes. So you take a mortal. <laughs> That's it. Just one. Just one mortal. Yeah, depravity point. Not like this. And then into your little sloppity bile piper guy. Yeah, that was fun. 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 What a turn that was, Lionel. Oh. That was a great turn for the Slanesh. So, uh, the Fiends charge in. You did pop off the You Can't Pile In. That was actually, that caught me off guard. Because he's, that guy's so good. I like he's, uh, him. he's super clutchy. He was good. You did find a sour him, which did keep him alive. Yes. So, he has one wound left. Yes. I have taken a casualty in one wound there. They've taken two wounds. The Fiends are okay. The Lord of Pain has taken wounds. Glutos is up to... <laughs> He healed <laughs> by killing, overkilling a, a, a toad by one. You did kill a few of these, Myrmidesh, and the twin souls just nuked a toad. That was incredible. Yeah. Even without their crazy buffs. Oh, that was pretty awesome. That was awesome. I did get seven depravity points this turn, bringing me my total up to seven. I mean, total up to eight again. So I'm uh, very close to getting another keeper. <laughs> <laughs> Which is really Alexis, fun for me. Thank God you don't have another one. But yeah, yeah. I've got demonettes and stuff and a little character yeah, that I might be able to bring crap. in. Sure, it was cool, keepers. right? Sure. Nah, nah. I just wanted to give a huge shout out to Mini Wargaming that let me borrow the army for this battle report. Beautiful army. It is. Vito painted it. It looks yeah. really nice and I love it. Glutose is a boss. I love him so much. He's so yeah, good. He's so good. Okay, yeah. uh, ready for this. Uh, I did get five points this turn. Because I killed, I hold, and I hold more than you. Yes, sir. Which is uh, gets me back in the game, which I'm yep. really excited about. Okay, here goes. Hiya! I will take it. <laughs> Done. I will. Ah, I will okay. take it. You can go ahead and take one that objective away, or that one, or whatever, uh, or that one. Yeah. It's up to you. 
but uh, I definitely want this double turn yeah. to uh, to get into the to get me back into the game, which is exciting as well. So I did get the battle turn here, which is awesome. So Glutos, uh, I do have to roll for him to see if he gets his ward save, which I haven't yet. So does oh, Glutos get his ward save? He does, so I'm a two plus. So Glutos' ward save is up, the prayer is answered. I did stab myself to get a <laughs> depravity point and then fail to heal myself with the power. The fiends, I, I did pick try and kill the general this turn, so the fiends have just kind of moved up, and I'm going to try and make a nice charge to go and try and kill. The but stayed general. outside of nine, so he doesn't I did, redeploy. so he doesn't redeploy, which is important. Yes. I was able to heroic recovery the Lord of Pain, and I took the disease off. I know I get less depravity that way, but I kind of want him for the mid to late game. Uh, completely healed, so it's that's good for me there. Mm -hmm. And then Sigvald has just uh, moved this way, just within nine of that toad but not within nine of any of the other totes. And, and no you failed to dispel I did. my mirror. Man, I've just been really mm. horrible in the magic phase. <laughs> mm -hmm. Your magic phase, Glutos is like, bah, 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 bah. Uh, Other than that, that's it. So we're gonna uh, continue the movement phase here. End of the movement phase. I've decided to move the keeper up and I move the Bliss Barb Seekers away. I like to call them the free keeper. The free keeper! <laughs> That's right. And then we got the fiends. They've just moved up, of course. Yep. Uh, Glutos stayed in combat together with all of them. So their disease markers went up. With an arcane bolt. That's right. He does have an arcane bolt, which he will use at the start of the... Whatever phase. Charge phase now. Because sure. whatever. whatever. It doesn't matter. Uh, however, my mirror is going to go. And then at the end of the movement phase, Sigvald did summon 10 demonets here. Because that guy moved back. So it helps me just take that objective over there. So with that, let's do mirror. Mirror on the wall time. Oh, yeah. So mirror, mirror on the wall. In, you know, let's do the general second. Let's go into the sloppity bile piper. Okay. So how many? No mortal wounds. Okay. Oh no. Yes. You put it all on him. Cause the odds now. <laughs> They're a lot higher. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Just one mortal. All right. <laughs> Five sixes. Yeah. Take another one. You're down to four. Wounds. That's another depravity. That well, if he survives. That's Correct. True. Yeah. Oh, it's a she. So she, sorry. If she survives, <laughs> she has the she has the whole getup and everything. Yeah. If she survives, then that'll be a depravity point. Uh, okay. Start of the shooting phase. They ran away, so they don't get to shoot. Uh, Glutos is too lazy to shoot. <laughs> and oh, I should have moved him. That's okay. Move him. Move him. Sounds good. He's gonna get mortal wounded to death anyway. Um, and then of course, let's dive into the charge phase. Sounds good. Glutos is going to. Uh, D3, <laughs> three, into the little toad. Three mortal wounds? From the arcane bolt. Oh, sorry. Because he's close. Ooh, doesn't care. Okay. Okay, well, let's do Sigvault. Actually, no. This, this was another sacred number three. That's true. That's, that's why true. I made him. I need to roll them. Also three. That's so right. now that's against you. Let's see what happens. If it's Those a fiends. nine, you also don't like nine. Ah, <laughs> uh, who knows? Come on, fiends. Not with a seven. <laughs> Sacred seven. Not with a seven. They can't charge here, though. Um, That's a possibility. Now, as soon as he dies, does that non-pile-in thing kick? Like, uh, it kicks off at the beginning. Okay. And then it's there for the beginning, but it has to be fourteen inches. So him. when he dies, does so that go dies, away? The fourteen inches will then. So, so when he's dead, it goes away. Okay. But yeah, because it's. Okay, right, I'm gonna 14. take that seven. I'm gonna move seven, so, and then hopefully that Lord of Pain can come in and punch that guy enough to kill him, and then it allows me to pile in into your general. Well, the Lord of Pain didn't make it, which means I'm probably not going to kill the general. Wah, wah, wah. Um, the reason why is because he's going to make me not be able to pile in. Which means these guys... To him. They can't pile in towards him. Can they pile in towards him? or is it, Oh, he's a demon too. Uh, is he a demon? Or is he a mortal? Well, let me check the keyword. Yeah, because if, if he's not a demon, then I, I'm pretty sure I'll be able to get yeah, in there. Yeah, you can. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because uh, that actually might matter. You'll be able to get one. Yeah, yeah, which is fine. He's yeah, got, you you'll got, be able to get one because yeah. this is the closest. And, and it's, they've got a, he can go this way to get closer. Oh, maybe. We'll, we'll see. We'll figure it out. It out. We'll figure but they do have like a two inch reach on some of their attacks. Yeah, 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 so yeah, yeah. I'll just if check you, it. This guy can't. It'll be a slim chance. 
Sigvald, however, did roll a 10. Yes! <laughs> and they just went rah, right into there. So that's going to be interesting there. Uh, and over here, of course, the keeper just went in and is going to do some damage over there. So with that, uh, let's do some fighting. And let's see. So, beginning of combat? Yep. No palace. Okay. To, towards the demon, so I can't get closer to him. You can't get closer to any demon within Ooh. 14. That means I can't actually fight with it, like any of these, because they're just within three. Uh, unfortunate that is, yeah, that is that's, that's going to be nasty. <laughs> Um, and then over here, we're going to yeah. go ahead and do Sigvald first, because that happens at the start of the fight phase. I'm just going to go ahead and do five and five. Doesn't have to be this way. <laughs> you know, we'll see what happens. He hits on two. Because he's a man. Cool. And I believe he went on three. You rolled one. I know, and I rolled a six, which makes the one a hit. Because I'm Slanesh! <laughs> <laughs> Threes. Ah, uh, just one. Uh, thank you, Slanesh. Just one. D3 damage. Uh, it's AP two or three, and you take lots. three damage. So I you just goes three damage? Three damage. No so saves there, my good sir. Dead. He's Sigvald. He's Sigvald. <laughs> was I about to save? You were going to try. I was, I was just about to And uh, into the other toad. Okay. There you go. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, looks Ooh. like that guy's in trouble. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that guy might be in trouble. Go, Sigvald. Go. <laughs> Uh, okay, so that'll be uh, five D3s. Let's go, Toady! And I was about to drop on my turn. Okay, so, end of the turn. Yes, sir. Um, I wasn't able to kill him, but I do hold both the objectives, so I do get three points for that. However, um, I killed a few more of the beasties. I killed the Sloppity Bile Piper. Uh, until he gets summoned again. How many points is he to be resummoned? <laughs> I got it. I've, I've been on it for a little bit now. Yeah, it makes sense. Uh, he's like seven to seven. Okay, fair enough. Um, I'm at 12 before my turn starts. I like it. Other than that, I got eight more depravity points, bringing my total back up to 10. So I need two more depravity points, and I get another keeper. <laughs> not, that, not that I have another keeper. I should have brought the, the second one. But the thing is, we should keep The thing is, we this. know that we could. <laughs> That's why I, I summoned the demonettes, because I knew I was going to get depravity this turn, and then Lionel might double turn me, which then means that I'd get two turns worth of summoning points. So you want to use them when you have them um, to do things like mission objectives and whatnot as we move into the game. However, uh, the general it has, what, two wounds left? Almost. Uh, two wounds. Almost got him. Didn't do any more. He's going to heal quite a bit. I Yeah, he's, he's going to, like, I, I can't kill him anyway. So Festus, which is what this guy has healed, knock back a potion. Nice. And he'll deal D3. And then... And then they'll heal one. Cool. Uh, except he's also a loca. So, so he'll it's actually D3. heal D3. So two D3 he's healing. Yeah, and nice. then everything within 14 of them will also heal D3. Nice. Yeah. So, because he is a loca, which yeah. will heal that one, heal that Potentially one. Potentially that one. And that's all the that's stuff it. that's wounded. you've killed so much. I have, yeah. which has been really fun. Terrible. Okay. <laughs> Lionel's Terrible. like, you've killed so much of my army. And you got a free keeper. I did. I lose models, you gain models. That's this how this, this is how it works. This is the cycle of life. That's right. It's the cycle of life. <laughs> just, just like that. It's, just, just like it's that. riveting. Um, other than that, let's dive into battle round three. Um, turn, bottom of the turn. Yeah. Which is the Nurgle third turn. And here we are after the boomer phase on turn three. Um, that fell back, was able to take the mirror away, finally, so that he could move all of his stuff away from the mirror. If not, he would have been taking mortal wounds and everything. And more he is like now... you would be just gaining correct. more stuff. I would, I'd do, I would. <laughs> and he's just going to try and kill Sigvald. He's got all of these guys ready to run in and do some damage. <laughs> yeah, basically, I have two, four, six, eight, ten models. Yep. Uh, if this guy makes a charge... Sure. Probably likely. Twelve models, yeah. or potentially. So yeah. we've got we've got a lot of stuff on there. I've got ten models on there plus Sigvald. So I've got twelve. He needs to kill Sigvald. Other than that, he should be able to. And then he's hoping for a double turn to clear this and then push into my objective over here. All right. So with that, let's dive into the oh, charge phase. Oh, you did. Aha! Aha! Nine. Oh no, ten. Ten, ten corruption points for yeah. that. Yep. Uh, cool. Okay. So with that, let's dive into. Uh, the charge phase. After the charge phase, Sigvald had four wounds left. He now has one wound remaining. <laughs> yes. Because one toad rolled a one. Oh, don't say it like that. <laughs> <laughs> and don't then this guy him. killed two more. Yeah. I do blame that toad. <laughs> that toad should have done that job better. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, let's do some. Uh, let's do some combats. Yes. End of battle round number two. I mean three. End of battle round number three. I will be getting one, two three 
four more depravity points. <laughs> four more, which does bring my total up to 14. Yay. <laughs> four more depravity points, which is super exciting. And uh, Lionel does get three more points. So that helps me offset the uh, two points that I missed on the first time around, uh, not getting my battle tactic, which is I need to do that one more time, and then that'll be equal in terms of points, and then we'll move into other stuff as well, which is really exciting. Okay, so with that, Lionel, are you ready? Yeah, buddy. Okay, we got this. It is the initiative roll. I rolled a six. So I, I will uh, take it. hold on to the initiative, because yeah, yeah. I believe that's, that's what I need to do here. That's fair. I will go for putting models in the back of your zone as my battle tactic. A Savage Spearhead. Yep, Savage Spearhead. That's yep. the one that I'll be doing, because yep. I have two units basically ready you to do to that. You have to get into this the, uh, Yeah, up territory. to here, yeah, so yeah. they can just uh, get around this way. Here. Yeah, or down that way. And this guy can yeah. just loop in. Exactly. Yeah. They're just going to... You just have to hold it with it. That's I'm going to do that. Okay. Good, Slanesh. Let's go. Battle round number four. Assuredly. Okay, so end of the phase. I did <laughs> end of the movement in hero phase. Glutos healed uh, another couple of wounds. He's almost at full again. The Lord of Pain has just moved up. The Fiends have moved up. I did put the mirror down. I put Mystic Shield on the Keeper. Uh, other than that... Glutus can now advance the charge and cast three powers. He's got a little arcing bolt. The demonets are re retreated from combat. I, this is a vice leader, so the herald of Slanesh. Mm -hmm. So I have a herald here as well now, which I summoned because I don't have another keeper, but I could bring another keeper. You would have had another keeper. Which uh, I would have put record. right here and yeah. then would have tried for to... <laughs> for the record, another keeper just coming in. I love I love Slanesh so much. It's so, so much fun. Uh, okay, but I did want to show you the mirror, mirror, mirror <laughs> on the wall. Uh -oh. Who is the fairest uh -oh. of them all? Uh, what is the uh, what is the wheel to now? Oh, so the, dig the wheel is at a natural vitality. Okay. Uh, my characters have a four plus one. Okay, yeah, yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, right. so do I do lots of mortals? No. <laughs> One, one day, day. <laughs> one day I'm going to roll day. absolutely incredibly like high on that. Uh, and it's going to be amazing. But until be... then, <laughs> no. So we're here at the end of my turn. Um, I killed, I think, one more one more uh, little guy. D the, yeah, the, 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 the plague toads. Mm -hmm. I didn't kill him, though. Again. <laughs> but I did get my battle tactic, and I hold to hold more this time, which is great. Um, I did get nine more depravity points. So if this was a keeper, if you're keeping track, I would have had two more wounds to then have another two more depravity points to then have another keeper on uh, the fifth battle round. So mm -hmm. I would have had three keepers three this keepers. game, yeah. which is awesome. I love uh, the contagion points make it very fun for me. Oh, yeah. And then all the multiple units. <laughs> yeah. It's just, you oh, just yeah. like, ka-ching. It's so great. Ka -ching. I absolutely love the it. The only thing keeping this game even remotely fair is the fact you just don't have your whole collection. Correct. Yeah, I don't have access box. to everything. If yeah. not, then you know this I would, would literally been, I, other keeper. I would have tried to charge in another keeper. It would have been great fun. It's pretty funny. <laughs> yeah, it's it's hilarious. Okay, so with that, we're going into turn four for the Nurgle. What is your battle tactic, my I good am sir? I'm gonna pick ferocious advance. Now this is Re a uh, crazy one for me, right? Because I can run in charge. Yeah, yeah. So it'll be good. You just have to make sure they stay alive. The ones that you pick. No. I just have to end my move and it's done. Oh, okay. You just it's do right it at the end of the move. move. Okay, perfect. It's, boom. Which works really well. That'll be your last, like your second to last one. And then hopefully you can get into my territory to get your last one, essentially. Or uh, I'm hoping, kill to, my gain, general I'm hoping or... to gain uh, priority on my next round. Right. If I can score then, even if you, well, we'll find out. We'll find out. It's yeah. going to be close. It's, yeah, which is good. It's definitely going to be neck and neck, which is going to be awesome. And he does have the three models to advance the charge. <laughs> like, literally right close. I mean, I also have broken so, ranks as an option. On uh, you already, this, you already broken no, ranked. Um, well, I did. Yeah, I did. yeah, yeah, you already did. Yes, I you did. took broken ranks did. Turn, did turn two. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah that, one's, that one's gone. They, yeah, yeah. You, very, those very claw spears just die. They just well, very, very dead. What I was going to suggest, what I was going to say is this doesn't count for broken ranks. That does Yeah, correct. Yeah. And they're not battle line. They're not battle line. Oh, they're not? No. The Mirmidesh are battle line, but they are not battle line. I can't believe I confused the two. Yeah. Well, they're very, very similar. <laughs> Mirmidash pain bringers. Ah, Mirmidash yeah. twin souls. Oh, so obvious. Lionel, get so, with the program. So obvious. Okay, let's move on to hero phase and stuff. Yes, sir. 
Okay, so end of the moving phase. Mr. Slow Man, that can oh, only move sorry. two and a half just, inches. Just gonna move? Yep. Just up there? Two just a little closer? There. I well, like within it. three. Yep. Sorry, pardon me. Yeah, no problem. Yeah. Um, okay, so they, they her ferociously advanced. <laughs> cool. Yeah, you got it. Uh, he fell back. He yeah. can't actually run oh, away. Because he's... fall back. Oh, yep. Yeah. Nope. That was about it. I don't get another, another d- diseasy point on there. No. However, the no mirror course. is still up. Yes, sir. So, because you tried to cast a mystic shield that then Glutos promptly dispelled, which was great. So that means mirror, mirror on the wall. Right Stare into oh, that suck. the depths below. Oh. One mortal. No. It's still on a four plus. Though. I am. Yeah. Come on, can I be Another more? depravity point. <laughs> you did heal too. You, he healed a whole bunch of stuff. He did, yeah. Uh, but he, you know, so he's he's back down to three taken. So he has three remaining. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Okay, so with that, we're going to dive into the combat phase. Oh, the charge phase. You know what I mean. There's no shooting here. No. There's no shooting. Oh, you did uh, summon another beast. Yes. They're so good. They're so silly. I love it. Who's charging first? Uh, this beastie's going to charge okay. first. Okay, beastie first. And needing a knife. Nice. And that was it. He's going to burn today. a CP because I can't. He is. He's going to try. You want to try kill these fiends? Uh, I'm going to try, yeah. I like it. No, not today. Not gonna do it. With so that. he's done. Okay. Uh, this guy is gonna charge. Okay. He does. <laughs> where, he goes ten. where was that? I don't know. Uh, it was in the dice somewhere. Uh, can I do that? Yeah, you can move. You said. You oh move right, I can move it, through right? it. I forgot about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, right. yeah. Just can't yeah, end right. on it. That's right? correct. Yeah, that's correct. Uh, so on a two plus. Ooh. D three. You know the thing is, I take a mortal. Mark. Another depravity point. Excellent. I'm living with the mixed two remaining. Of old and two remaining. New. Yeah, no worries. On that and one. then you've got us these three and that one. Charge here. That toad first. Yeah, that that toad. Okay. We're in first. Yeah. You don't have to declare where you're charging. No. He goes seven, so seven you can uh, like roll it. If you're within twelve, an enemy, then you can kind of move wherever you're allowed to move. Mm-hmm. As long as you end within half an inch of uh, units, essentially. All right, yeah, exactly. So I'm going to end right there within an inch of both. So okay. I impact both, believe it or not. Within an inch of both? Yeah. And no, you're within, within half, an half inch, inch of them? This. Okay, and, and within they're an inch both, of them. Exactly. Okay. So the, the Mirmidash. The Mirmidash, nice. They uh, take just one, one mortal wound. five up because they're on their defensive profile. They're okay. Okay, and then the Demonettes, Demonettes takes one. So one demonite goes down. There it is. Couple up. Uh, well, yeah. Let's uh, let's just kill. Well, I don't need the mirror. I mean that one. So dead. Uh, this toady. The little toad over here. Nice. A eight. An eight. Nice. There he goes. Where is he going? I wanted to drop one of these here. I want to do the same thing. Uh, to see if I could avoid him. Oh so right, I, I get him. it. I get it. Involved in the combat. Because Glutos is pretty awesome. Well, he's awesome enough. Yes. He he's literally been a pain in Lionel's side wow. so much. In this, it's perfection yeah, versus me. Absolute perfection. Uh, do I do anything? You do. I do three. Three into the Mirmidash Twin Souls. Okay, so three of them. I lose one, so one goes down. I'll take it. Good luck. Those, mir- those twin souls have done so much work. Yeah. They are crazy into this matchup. I love uh, it. Then over here. This guy? Yeah. Cool. That little toad. What's mm-hmm. he doing? He's going five. five. That should yeah. be it. He makes it into the demon. Yeah, that should be Look. Uh, he wants to try and take the objective to mm-hmm. get at least a point. Well, I'll be getting at least three if I take the objective. Um, I completed my first advance. Oh, that's right. Yeah. That's right. Uh, and three. Onto the demons? Yes, sir. Cool. So I will kill these three. Sounds like a plan. Ah, have to keep that I banner alive. Because that banner is, uh, allows me to bring back And models. then I will... The last guy? Five. five. We'll see if, I think, maybe. Mm, I potentially. Got. I think so. Yeah, I think so. I think so. I don't think there's yeah. almost any way that... No. Yeah. I don't think there's, like, any way I can not get murdered there. Uh, there you go. Good old toads. This is on him. That's on him. That's on him? Okay. Yeah. Him. Yep. Oh. And everything's on. Okay. Nice. Cool. Do you hit um, the demonettes again? We'll find out. Uh huh. Yep. One more one. Ah. Dead. Okay. Okay. Now combats. Yeah. And we'll come back off to combat. Done. We don't even have to play the round. We can just. Okay. Focus on <laughs> <laughs> no, we're playing it. 
What's there to play, really? Like, <laughs> I want to murder more ah, things than Kalutos. Yeah. So, you know, because who knows? I got three wounds here. No, I can't kill four of them in a turn. That's just not... Like, it's very unlikely for me to kill four in a turn. Because then I, if I did kill the four, I'd drop you down your battle tactic. No, dude. What I'm trying to say is if you win this priority right now, this guy's... Cool. Then I take this and with I stop so, you from even being able right. to get so on So you're going to get one, yeah, two. Uh, what's your other... Uh, the last one would be left. Conquer, which would be take two. Uh, that's aggressive expansion. Yep. Uh, and yeah, you just have to take the two. Yeah. So, so it'd be five for that. You would just... You wouldn't even and really even then, bother great. Just engage yeah. with this and keep these almost yeah. out. Oh, yeah. unless, well, mind you, three knocked out a friggin' toad last time. They did. This toad has three wounds left. Well, but I also have the keeper that can come in and he's five, right? Yeah, and there. he's not engaged. Yeah, so, so anyway, he can move if around. If you win, yep. you'll take this and this. Yep. Uh, score aggressive expansion, so yep. that'll be five points. Okay, right? I like it. No, it makes sense. Like, that, I, I, I make sense. It's been a this fantastic game so far. This is it. This okay. is for all the marbles. That's right. Which chaos god is better? One dice roll. Oh, don't put it that way. <laughs> oh, man. That's, that's too right. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> that's too Wait, which is Slanesh's number? I don't want to know. Which is Slanesh's number? Can I roll a seven on it? <laughs> which is Slanesh's number? Oh, a it. six? Come on, baby. No! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Good game, my good, good sir. Game, good game, uh, that'll good be <laughs> what, what a crazy game. <laughs> After action report, Lionel. Um, what do you think of it? I think it's awesome. But for the record, he, you know, I gotta take this. Back. We're all alone right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah, we're just and we're all fully vaccinated, we're folks. Yeah, yeah, we're, we're good. all fully we're good. vaccinated. You we're good. Give me. That's right. We also need to oh. show off the great, uh, the great man. What a great beard and stash he got rocking. I love it. I my love wife. It. Not so much. Anyway, <laughs> he was going to summon his third keeper this round. I was. So although this looked really close, um, honestly, that point this, this should have been a keeper. Yep. Right there. And I have another one. And if you had maybe failed to charge, yep. then I would have maybe had a char uh, a chance. Uh, you didn't even attempt to that. No, or no. made a passage for it no. because it didn't matter. Like right? this turn, I would have just brought my fiends back so because like, I had Roll that die right now. Make me feel better and fail, the, fail a charge. Nine. Okay, uh, re-roll re -roll. Re -roll it. Nine. <laughs> See? Would have lost. Would have lost because he would have made it in. And then you don't have enough toads no, to take that back and stuff. All yeah. the snippy snippies would have You know what? I will say, mm. I love Hidden Ice and Smash. They're yeah. so fun. I, They're so fun. This is this is awesome. I, uh, this is everything I love about AOS. I love all the the tactical positioning that happened in the play. Rid, you're doing amazing with picking up the game. Freaking love playing. Love playing you, man. You're doing You're doing great. Thank you. Um, I appreciate it. I can't now, wait till you like, go to your first competitive event. <laughs> Drop 40K. Yeah, 40 <laughs> 40K, Schmorty K, right? Yeah, man. Uh, I'm excited about the Arby's code, though. Yeah, well, is Chaos. it, uh, it's, uh, and it's also, um, well, Eldar for 40K, but I mean, yeah. you've got, uh, for AOS, you've got the Doors of Cain. No, is it Doors of Cain? No, you have. You're not wrong. It, um, the, the next one is it Dwarves and the. IDK, so yeah, yeah. Idenet Deepkin. Yep. Uh, Fire Slayers is uh, the next one hot on the heels of that. Yeah. Little. Anyway. Hot on the heels uh, of Fire Slayers? <laughs> no. I no, get it. Uh, I, uh, I totally get it. Ah, 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 and then almost uh, almost assuredly, we'll see. Um, what, sorry, the, the army you just mentioned, God's sake, is that kidding? Heat Knights is finished? No. No, I wish. Uh, Daughters of Cain. Daughters of Cain. There you go. I, I'm really excited. I've been practicing with a few couple of Doors of Cain builds. I still need to, like, I'm kind of waiting for the new book. But this, I don't know why, but playing Sun and Ash just fits my play style so much. Oh, I love it. Love it's like just the way that it plays. It. it was it was really fun. I love these guys. Yeah, the Bliss Barb Seekers are so good. So freaking cool. Also, what, what, Vito. Yeah, Vito. Vito, you did mwah, bellissimo. Yeah, uh, this is this is really nice. Yeah, thank you so much, uh, Mini Wargaming, for letting me bring the studio army that yeah, was man. painted by Vito. Yeah, yeah. Uh, in order for me to play Lionel here at <gasps> Exponent uh, down in. Deep up because we're close. Yeah, it's all good. <laughs> yeah, no, there were there were some people playing here earlier and stuff, but like huge stuff. You've got like events and whatnot happening. Yeah, and stuff. we got a uh, 40k crusade kicking off in March. We have like 35 people gonna be. That is incredible. In that. Yeah, it's gonna be fun. You know what's crazy? So everyone's just kind of nervous. Oh, I don't know if I want to play. I don't want to. Don't worry about it. Three out of 35 people, three guys go to tournaments regularly. 
Nice. All the other people of people you don't normally see in any tournament. Spend two years of building lists for people too exactly. that they've been at home and exactly. like they just coming out and playing, doing exactly. some crusade. And then we have our 40k tournament, uh, which is sold out. But we're going to be opening up more seats and love to see all your faces. Riven's not invited, apparently. Of course. No. No. Why, why, why would he be? Exactly. <laughs> and then we also got an Age Sigma event. Happy Lionel doesn't top. want me to play 40k. <laughs> Why would you? Don't, don't tempt me, Frodo. <laughs> anyway, this is wicked. Thank you very much for the game. This was a lot, a lot of fun. Uh, oh, absolutely. A pleasure, Lionel. Thanks so much for having me. I love your list concept. Thank it is you. filthy. Just so everybody knows, the real list concept has Bellacor in it. Yeah. Um, it's just yeah. not painted as well. Yeah. Yeah. Now, you are a member of the W. The WTC, no, the ETC Canadian team for AOS. Yes. Correct. Yes. And I was very lucky, very fortunate enough to, and honored. The guys are just all lovely that are on the team. They're all really great players. I'm there to drag them down, hopefully take a few f punches to the That's face. That's right. You know what? <laughs> if they have to bust someone, they might as well bust you, Lionel. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Other than that, huge shout out to all the channel Patreons, without whom none of this would be possible. Thanks so much for hanging out with me today and uh, Lionel. And I hope you enjoyed this Age of Sigma Battle Report, the tactics involved, and all the fun times. I'm just going to roll the mirror one more time. Because... Don't do it. I don't want you to do it. Oh, Take that. No, boo. <laughs> boo. There you go. Take four mortal wounds. Come on. One day, one day I'm going to roll six sixes. It's going to be incredible. Okay, on that, thanks a lot, everybody. This is Scary, your grateful host, signing off until next time. Ah, Glutos! Look at him, he's so fat. <laughs>